Council, IPA, River State, Coalition of Political Parties, CPP, and Coalition of Governorship Candidates in River State, hereby call on the National Chairman of the Independent National Electoral Commission, INEC, Professor Mahmoud Yakubu, to disregard calls by few relegates APC sponsored governorship candidates for the transfer of the River State's resident electoral commissioner and the state administrative secretary of INEC. We represent 86 political parties and 54 governorship candidates. These calls sponsored by the Minister of Transportation and APC are aimed at creating the ugly atmosphere for the concussion of results and the rigging of the River State governorship election, which has been won by the River State PDP governorship candidate, His Excellency, Chief Barrister Nyesom Ezewon Winke. We also strongly condemn the criminal use of the Nigerian army by the APC to abduct electoral officers and snatch already collected results for the purpose of rigging the governorship election in favor of the APC's supported candidates. It is most unfortunate that the APC led soldiers of the Nigerian army to invade the state coalition center at INEC headquarters in Port Harcourt as captured on videos aired on channels TV, channel television, and AIT. The whole world saw how they planned to bring in cooked results to alter the will of Rivers people. We also condemn the military for disrupting the coalition process for the governorship election in River State. We call on President Buhari to take immediate steps to punish all the military personnel involved in this coup against democracy. Our position is strengthened by the fact that the Chief of Army Staff has denied ordering the criminal activities of the Nigerian Army at the River State Governorship Coalition Center at INEC headquarters in Port Harcourt. The mischievous call by these sponsored governorship candidates is diversionary and aimed at disrupting the coalition process and the lawful declaration of Governor Wike as duly re-elected governor of River State. We commend the River State governor Yes, I'm the one weekend for his peaceful and calm disposition, despite the provocation, provocative actions of the APC and the military in the face of the fact that Rivers people overwhelmingly voted for him. We urge INEC to immediately restart the process of collating the governorship election results based on official res results declared at all polling units where elections were successfully conducted. This coalition should be based on official INEC staff and ACHO staff personnel details to conduct the elections. We therefore congratulate the River State Governor, Yosem Ezewonwike, on his re-election as the Governor of River State. We congratulate him based on results from across the states as made available to us by our agents who participated in the elections at different levels. The position is further confirmed by the fact that INEC state constituency coalition officers across River State have declared 23 PDP candidates as duly elected for their respective constituencies for the state assembly elections, which ran simultaneously with the governorship election won by the River State Governor, Chief Barrister Eze won yes on the case. <laughs> Finally, we condemn the Minister of Transportation, Chibuka Roti Miyamechi, for using the Nigerian army to shed blood simply because he wants to rig the governorship election. This press statement is signed by Sir Precious Baritondo Barido, Chairman of IPAC in River State. Patrick John Woko, Secretary, IPAC River State. Comrade Kukang Joseph Ledum, Chairman, CPP. Honorable Sedionian Ama Pepo, Secretary, CPP. Pastor Samuel Ihuwon, Chairman, Forum of River State 
2019 governorship candidate. And the King Honorable Ima Wambieje, Vice Chairman, Forum of River State 2019 governorship candidate. And all other chairmen and CPP members and governorship candidates that are here seated for this press conference. Thank you very much. <laughs>